Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. In this video lecture, we are going to discuss about Henry Fielding. He was born on 22nd of April 1707 and was died on 8th of October 1754. So, Henry's genre was comedy, satire and picaresque. Picaresque is a term relating to an episodic style of fiction dealing with the adventures of a rough and dishonest but appealing hero. So, Picaresque is basically a term that uh, is used in the novel that is adventurous, very roughly constructed, which is a hero that is very rough, tha, but still, wo as a hero, he represents it. बहुत सारी बुराइयां होने के बावजूद he is the hero and satire the use of humor to attack a person एक तरह का humor होता है comedy करने के लिए किसी एक person को poke करने के लिए इस तरह की चीज़ होती firstly we will discuss about his life and his basic education Henry was born at Sharfam, Somerset, England in 1707 his father's name was Edmund Fielding and was a lieutenant general in British army officer his mother's name was Shara Goldfielding was an English author and also the daughter of a judge he sent to school at Eton in 1719 he then enrolled at the University of Leiden in the Netherlands where he studied classical literature Fielding also studied law at Middle Temple and became a successful barrister and ma magistrate. So, we can see that their life is very good. They have studied a lot. Their father was also in a good post. Their mother was also in a good post. She was an English novelist. Their father was a lieutenant general. And Fielding had also studied लिटरेचर की भी पढ़ाई की थी एंड नेक्स्ट बाद में जाके इन्होंने बैरिस्टर की भी पढ़ाई की थी इन्होंने लॉ की डिग्री भी हासिल की थी लेट्स कम टू हिज मैरिजेस फिल्डिंग मैरिड चार्लोटी क्रैडॉक इन 1734 एट द चर्च ऑफ सेंट मेरी इन चार्लकॉम सोमरसेट एंड हैड फाइव चिल्ड्रन एंड आफ्टर द डेथ ऑफ चार्लोट इन 1744 ही अगेन मैरिड हर फॉर्मर मेड Married Daniel and also had five children with her. Henry Fielding was an English novelist, irony writer, and dramatist known for earthy humor and satire. So, in ki jo bhi works hoti thi, jo bhi novel likhte the, jo jis bhi tarah ki in ki works hua karti thi, isme bahut humor aur satire hua karta tha. Henry was an author of 18th century. In Henry's novel, in which the author himself tells the story and controls the plot structure and considers the first accurate portrayal of contemporary manners. So, Henry ki jo novels hoti thi na, unka bhoat hi alag tarah ka likhne ka tarika hota tha. Unke jo author hote the, wo khud hi saari chizo ko control karte the aur khud hi saara plot structure tayar karte the. Fielding is the first realistic painter of life and society. और फील्डिंग का जो लिखने का जो भी तरीका होता था या जो भी चीजें वो लिखते थे उनका जो सब्जेक्ट होता था वो बहुत ज़्यादा रियल लाइफ से जो हमारी सोसाइटीज में हो रहा है जो हमारे लाइफ में होता है इन सब चीजों से रिलेटेड सब्जेक्ट रहता था। He totally wrote twenty six plays. Sir Walter Scott called fielding is a famous phrase, the father of English novel. He said that Fielding had high notions of the dignity of art which he may be considered as having founded. His literary movement was Enlightenment, Augustan age. So he was from Augustan age. Fielding's style of writing is very simple, explanatory and vivid. Fielding began his literary life as a playwright but his best work as a novel was Tom Jones. So Tom Jones, who Fielding ne likha tha, ye unki jo novel thi, ye abhi bhi bahut hi masterpiece consider ki jati hai. Fielding lived in an age which was basically moral in outlook. The same it was an age 
which brought about a synthesis between emotionalisms and rationalisms. His philosophy is guided by the common sense morality of the age, fielding breeze bustling and energetic in his narrative to fielding ka jo bhi work hua karta hai na hua karta tha bahut hi energetic bhara hua karta tha bahut breezy hua karta tha fielding style of writing is very simple and explanatory and vivid jaisa ki maine aapko bataya his first play was love in several masques and was first released on 16th of february 1728 and here are some of his famous works tom jones obviously is a masterpiece and a comic novel published in 1749 joseph andrew it is a comic epic poem in prose form which was published in 1742 amelia it is a sentimental novel published in december 1751 and it was fourth and final novel by henry he died near lisbon portugal on october 8 his journal of a voyage to lisbon was published in the year after his death so that's it for this video lecture thank you everyone do like my videos and subscribe my channel